Okay, I go by the name Tyrell Kenya. I'm a cover artist, um, stroke official artist. Yeah, and I come from Mombasa, Kenya. Mombasa! Yeah. Mombasa in the building. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Yeah, of course. Yeah. Somewhere behind, uh, behind the scenes. Behind scene, yeah. Karibu sana, Tyrell. Welcome back to Lionesses. So, man, we are Thank so you. happy to have you, man. And, um, Kama Kawaida, guys, you know, get us first on Bay's uh, TV, you know, because in Safaricom TV, man, guys, you know, we are, we are, we are there live, man. Jibameni sana, man. Welcome, Tyrell. So, what have you been up to? You know, you've not been here for like, um, the last time you were here actually is like four months ago. Yeah, four months. Yeah, that will cost you season two, I'm in season three. Hey, we could do that. I remember you coming. We two are same here. We could go to Nime. You guys used to, were saying, but there I was blushing. Now I'm not blushing. Look at my face very well. <laughs> what have you been up to, Tyrell? Talk to us. Um, much more of um, business. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because you know, as much as you do music, you need to fund your music. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so. I've also been doing um, like official songs. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Wow, wow. So uh, briefly explain to us about this business. Business. Yeah. Okay, I'm a, I'm a video director. Oh, okay. Yeah, so I have my clients mm -hmm. who I shoot the videos, edit the videos. Mm -hmm. yeah. That's nice, that's nice. So I'm going to be with any shoot your video, Tyrell. <laughs> Tyrell, you need to do my t-shirt. I'm going to do my t-shirt. Not really, um, uh -huh. only one time. We'll one day, one time, mm -hmm. yeah. So, um, now let's talk about now. You said uh, last time you were here, you were basically a cover artist, yeah. You had not released any original music officially out there. So, tell us now what exactly what exactly have you been doing now to prove on the factor of your original music? Um, well, I do my cover songs, yes, I also do official songs, yeah, okay. So, um you know, official songs need much more input, you know, than covers. Covers, they just have to go and shoot, just dress nicely, yeah. perform nicely, you know. But officials need much more input in terms of transport, vixens, mm -hmm. scenes, locations. Mm -hmm. So I released a, a new song with Ska. Yeah, Ska. Yeah. <laughs> 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 yeah. And it's doing very well. Yeah. Yeah, and we're um, working on another one. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so time will tell. So to party a capella yongo ma kona ska. Ka capella kidogo to Tyrell. Now that I Seriously? For real. Checking me fishing for a compliment. Now for issues. Yeah. Uh -huh. Got it. Okay. Take it slow. Your hands on my waist. I want you to know. Nime kukufia Si ungeni show Nibebe pombe tulewe toto 
היא לא תקול, אני קורא גם ממה, נדר עשיית שינונו. אומייגוד, וואי! אוקיי, וואו, באק, אז אני רודי באק לדיס וואלד. You have a beautiful voice, Tyrell. Thank you, thank you. Thank wow, you. wow. Uh, so um, now tell us, how is the transition from mm -hmm. making cover music, yeah. you know, into your original mm -hmm. songs? Because, mm -hmm. uh, like you said, um, you know, like, uh, things work differently. Just tell us as an experience, you know, transitioning. How, how, what have you gone through that transitioning, you know? Mm -hmm. Like your confidence in finally, like, believing like you can release your own music instead mm -hmm. of only doing covers for other artists. How is the transition? And how, how are your... Fans, you know, responding to your transition. Yeah, um, the transition is uh, pretty much overwhelming at times. Yeah. But it's a challenge I agree to take. Okay. Yeah. So like, um, I'm much more confident because by doing covers, um, people got to accept me in the industry. Yes. Yeah. So doing official, people feel like they need to know my capability. Yeah. If I can really write my own songs. Yeah. And when I go to officials, I nail it also. Yeah. Yeah. So to me, it's not. Um, a big deal yeah because um, my fans say yes to them yeah yeah so to me it's just like an adventure and I feel like I should do more of officials you know yeah because covers covers is something that is inside me that um, I use for marketing yeah and to also showcase my vocal capability and ability yeah yeah so to me it's not like that much of a big deal though yeah. it's overwhelming because you know it's an official song so to get people mastering or cramming your lyrics mm. it's um, much more hectic than a cover song you know yeah but it's something good because uh, the feedback was positive amazing amazing you know i go through your stuff a lot because i mean i'm going number one fan you know <laughs> yeah and um has otile finally given you a big up you said that you said that you put a big up otile you put a big up i shall put a big up i mean have you guys now yeah. met have you like sort of like has he appreciated you the <clears throat> fact that you really like support his music you know because doing someone's cover is really supporting him it's like you're boosting him yeah um we haven't met but we talk Oh, okay. Yeah. So, uh, <laughs> how about the hashtag Timothy Le Brown? Yeah, hey. Yeah, yeah. So, tell us, mm -hmm. why are you Tile? Looking in the industry, I don't only do covers because uh, maybe it's a hit song, but it should be a cover that will also make my vocals grow. Mm -hmm. yeah? And also, like, um, good music. You know, Tile just does perfect and nice music. Yeah. Yeah, so I love him because he sets the bar for me. It's like a challenging factor for me okay yeah. so um now let's talk about now you being a an artist in the coast area yeah tell us about the advantages and disadvantages of being an artist based mm -hmm. in Mombasa rather than in Nairobi because um there are a few artists who have been talking to me mm -hmm. and they live outside town and they say hey man it's easier to make it in Nairobi do you agree with that concept I don't agree with it okay um, because in Mombasa, the advantage we have, we have a lot of scenes, yeah. like shooting scenes, mm -hmm. yeah, compared to Nairobi, the beaches and all that. Um, music is marketing. Yeah. If you do good music, first of all, you're supposed to do good music. Good music markets itself. Secondly, you market your music, be it from Mombasa, be it from anywhere, you can still make it. But, you know, people have the mentality, um, Nairobi, so you have to go to Nairobi to make it. Not really, but... Um, we, um, we all know we have the media houses in Nairobi. Yeah. That's the advantage of Nairobi. Yeah. And uh, people in Nairobi are much more receptive coming to like music and all that compared to Mombasa. So me what I do, I learned that I, I just release my songs back in Mombasa, but I do my marketing in Nairobi. Like my whole marketing comes from Nairobi. Which way to limit like I think a year ago. A year ago, I, I had nothing, literally nothing. So I approached Jerry, Nikoma um, and Jerry, I have a talent. You have the cameras, let's work together. Yeah. You know? So Nikoma and Jerry, I'll do what it takes to market your stuff, you know. Mm -hmm. I'll put my best in what I do. And one year down the line, she's seen that. She was, I am thankful sana because I was able to do it. You know, see, I see that she was then Jerry has never charged me any video. Wow! Yeah. Jerry, can I be your new best friend? <laughs> I need a best friend to see what I know for cash. That's she's, amazing. Yeah, she's never. Mm -hmm. you know, so, namshukuru sana for that. Because at the end of the day, she gets clients through me. Wow. Um, because me, I said, as an artist, I'll market her work. And she does good work. So, through that, I'm a client. You know, so that's how I repay her back. 
Yeah. Oh, mm. wow. I, I love that. I love when you have a very close relationship with people you work with. It helps the working environment be you know, a bit more soothing and stuff like that. All right, now let's talk about um, now your original yeah. music. Mm. Walk us through that. Una to drop your album, mm. una to drop your my singles, you know, because uh, like right now I've only seen the song with you and Scar. So yeah. is it your song or is it her song? Um, we both uh, play the part in it, like half half. Half half? Yeah. Okay, so like a marriage. <laughs> hey, 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 hey! Really, we move on, baby! Okay, so mm. walk us through about your original music. I mean, now tell us. How is this going for you for now? For now, no, because basically I want us to focus on the original music. Mm. Yeah, original music is yeah. good, mm -hmm. and um, I won't drop an album for now. Okay, because um, okay, drop album in Itajika, like you have a big niche, you can do like mm. a lot of fans and all that. Mm. So, right now, I'll just give the fans like single songs, but single perfect songs. Okay, very nice, lovely, lovely, very romantic. Romantic, <laughs> yeah. speaking of romantic, we have to play a song with Tyrell. Ah, not a song, Jesus. Actually, you're, you're so musical, I don't know this, but we have to play a game with Tyrell Kenya Manze. So, Jakama Kawede, let's not take him to a hotspot. Today, we are giving you three options with three female artists, Smash, Kill, Marry. And you cannot pass. You cannot pass. Hey, now today, because we have a slight crash on Tyrell, and she wake up a spot. From the camera, and you are category. I am giving you Jovial, Sironka, Avril, smash, kill, marry. <coughs> now, no, no, see, no, and then, jibu out of your heart. <laughs> see, threat. <laughs> Jovio, Sironka, Avril, okay. smash, kill, marry. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> So one, mm -hmm. admire you. Oh, <laughs> <Because, Aww. laughs> may I ask why? Um, because I've uh, I've been with you. Uh -huh. I know your characters, your traits, how you support people. You have a kind heart, of, and Aww. you're beautiful. Aww. So uh, yeah, admire you. I'd kill jovial. <laughs> <laughs> I'd kill jovial because I don't literally feel. A vocal. Uh huh. Like to me, she's just that. Uh huh. Yeah, not in a bad way. Uh huh. She does good music, but uh -huh. to me, uh uh. Uh huh. I'd smash her real. Uh huh. Why? Gather <laughs> hands. I love that. I love that. And I and I think you're a very incredible person too. You know, mm. see me behind the scenes, Cindy. No problem, Cindy. Mm. Mm. So like, okay, now Tyrell. Um, let me ask you. Yeah. Compared to the music growth in Mombasa in Nairobi, um, what do you what, what makes you think that Nairobi artists have better growth than artists in Mombasa? Because ukiangalia wasani what you are talented. In fact, I think coastal province has a lot of talent, a lot of it yeah, that is undiscovered. But why do you think that artists in Nairobi are making it more than artists in Mombasa? Um, artists in Mombasa refuse to grow. They refuse to grow. Like mm -hmm. you know, when an artist, a couple of artists have approached me, Terrell, how do you get your songs played on TV? Tyrell, how do you market your songs? You mm -hmm. know? <clears throat> I tell them marketing is all about money. Mtu hataki kutoa pesa yake kwa mfuko. Okay. At yani hataki. Unaweza mm. mwambia um marketing kama TV flani ulipe kama. It's not just like you're paying, you're appreciating mm. the the person involved. 2k. Mtu anasema 2k ni pesa. Mingi sijini ukimwambia shoot video na 10k ni cheap. Analia ba. Analia as in that is the problem. Alafu people are envious. Mm. People are envious. I get a lot of support from other counties mm. than my own county. Yeah. Unless the, the people who know me mm -hmm. from my county, those the own only support. But yeah. um kuna wengine yani kuna wengine Tuambie tu. Like um ni tulikuanga na tukianza nikianza mziki. Um siko na studio anything. Sasa all along I've been posting my covers, my songs. Mm. Had I repost, had I comment, Whoa. had I share. Say, I can't even TV. 
I know that guy, my brother's doing in the name. I'm like, bro, I'm like, I'm, I'm not your bro. Yeah, yeah, I'm not your bro. Ah, name dropping, man. He support me, Kianza. Yeah. Join the sort. Yeah. I carry all my people. Yeah. When I village, my son and I carry my people. I said, like, I carry my people. Yeah. Yeah. But as in, Nikianza Pali, you just despise me. Nikifika Huku, then you bring yourself, you, you start getting attached. I don't do that. Yeah. Mm. <sighs> because I believe that um, even for all artists who might be watching right now, man support each other. Man bringing each other down does not help because at the end of the day, you never know what that person will be in the future. So, man, they want to control you. But they want to control you. Last time we were here, somebody hey, ali, ali kwa sasa. <laughs> You've grown thick skin. Um, not really. I'm like eighty percent getting to a hundred. Mm -hmm. But comments in it to Yeah. But I don't let it get there because um I know my end game. Yeah. And I have a goal, so obviously kuna trolls. You just have to know how to deal with them. Yeah. 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 Okay. So how do you deal with women? <laughs> Tyrell unatuanga. Let me say, as a personal stalker of yours, because we wangalia bitu zako sana, because I'm a huge fan. How do you deal with women? Because like every time even when I repost you, mm. or when my friends repost you, guys are like, ah, mi ataka namba yo chali, mm. akone yo smile. Yeah. Ah, we, we get it. Because you have a billion dollar smile. So how do you deal with ladies? Mm. Um, to start, ladies uh, make like 80% of my fans and supporters. Yeah. Um, with the ladies, um, I have to look good. That's mm -hmm. not mine. I have to look good. Damn. Yeah, to maintain to maintain that picture. A lot of ladies, I wanna jump on home. So many kinona kiasi. I do it a bit. Them are the talkers that want to put it really hard in weight. Yeah. We we leave you. Yeah. <laughs> So um when I need to back, yeah. But you know, maybe they they have attachments and everything. I just um keep it professional. Yeah. I don't like ignore them because mm -hmm. at the end of the day, I need them as fans. Yeah. Mm -hmm. There's a de there's a way on how I deal with them. Yeah. I just engage them. You know, be we can't go past a certain limit. Yeah. Yeah. Ambia, we can be friends. Mm. We can call. We can chat. We can text. You know. But um commit. Mm. No. But don't you think that if you if you if you if you over engage with somebody you're calling them, you're you you know they're calling you, you're picking up, you know, they're chat don't you think you're sort of like giving them false hopes? No, um Mimi <laughs> It's sort of like a, a slight invitation, like ni kama anani entice, ni kama anani accept in a way. But don't you think that's leading them on? The thing I do, uh -huh. I'm talking it takes new number. Mm -hmm. The first like one, it's I think it's just the first day. Mm -hmm. again, eh? mm -hmm. But the second day I won't be there. Uh -huh. I want to be there to avoid these attachments. Yeah. You know, um, women are driven by like um, time, such such kind of factors. So they want to engage. You know, I feel home. I feel. See, I am a man. It's a foot. I can't part. I love to So the second day, I see the blue ticks. <laughs> but um, to maintain two leg distance, yeah. to maintain that respect, and once in a while. Nikki or Tony Maka, maybe um, I just check up on the person, I'm the people. Yeah. You know, I feel like I have a constant conversation with them. Yeah. But I really don't talk to a lot of people to avoid your attachments and necessary dramas. Yeah. Yeah. So I just stay with my close circle, SLG. Those are my close people if you see my status. Yeah. Well. Mm. So here is a hot question ah. Are you single, Tyrell? <laughs> um, are you still single? You have to tell us mm. because. I'm sure so many girls wanna know that, and like I've not, I've not even told the fans that you're coming. Man, they, I don't want people mm. going crazy in my messages. Yeah. Are you single, or are you seeing someone, or are you interested? Are you in love? Are you married? Or what? Okay, mm. so be better, but <laughs> where yeah. are you like in this whole thing? The whole thing. Um, yeah. I really don't wanna get messed up right now with love, so I'm just there. You're there. You're the manager. I don't understand this artist. You're the manager. I'm just mm. there. I mean, just tell us. Give us a little bit of hint about your personal life. My personal life. Yeah, give us like a behind the scenes. Give us like a behind the scenes. You don't go to. I'm not seeing anyone right now. You're not seeing anyone. Yeah. yeah. I'm just like alone. Alone. But
Social media handles at the end of the show. So now, um, now tell us about now. Um, where do you see yourself in the next ten years? Next ten years. Ten years is a lot. Yeah. Ten years is a lot. I can give myself. I'm just giving myself like this year. Uh huh. Just this year. Yeah. This because year. you see, if I give myself a longer period of time. Yeah. I'll be reluctant. Yeah. But if I have a short period of time to work on what yeah. I gotta do, I'll just do it. You'll just do so it. So just this year. Yeah. Oh, you wanted a long term thing. Yeah. I mean, do you, do you see yourself um, in the next 10 years? Let me just uh, brief on that. Do you see yourself still doing music? Or do you see yourself doing production? Or do you see yourself advancing into something else? Mm -hmm. I mean, where do you see yourself? Because, like. Um, yeah, um, for the meantime, like, let's say for the first few years, mm -hmm. I'll focus on music. Mm -hmm. Then my career is to become a pilot. Yeah. Hey, hey, <laughs> hey, so, what? So in the next 10 years, I'll be a pilot, struck musician. Oh, you want to go back to school? <clears throat> yeah, sure. You want to go back mm. to school? That's amazing. That's amazing. I like that. Mm -hmm. I like that a lot. Um, Now, Tyrell, mm -hmm. I, I, I just feel like I want to hear your voice. No, <laughs> ah, you cannot say that, but say. <clears throat> Party to a capella, Moja, or to one of your apples. Ever relocate to Nairobi? Hell no. <laughs> Hell, why? Why? Why don't you like Nairobi? Nairobi, um, my share Nairobi and Kalia hectic. What do you mean by that? Like, we have a lot of people in the streets, crowded, mm -hmm. theft, traffic. You, you saw that meme, um, literally, <laughs> literally be a police. <laughs> was just out of the box. Yeah. <laughs> like, well, how does that? So if somebody can do that to a police officer, mm. what about me? Just yeah. Citizen. Yeah. Yeah, I get it. I get it. Mm. Yeah. So let's uh, let's talk a little bit about your sister. Uh, yeah. You have a sister who is also doing uh, covers too. Yeah, Tell sure. us a little bit about uh, Sharon McLemore. Oh, Sharon is my elder sister. Oh, wonderful. Wow, really? Yeah. <laughs> How come you look older than that? <laughs> 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 uh -huh, yeah. Tell us a little bit about her. Yeah, so my sister does music. Okay. She has her YouTube channel. Mm -hmm. Doing pretty well. Yeah. Um, we work in the same studio, the same producer. That's nice. Yeah, so Mimi, what I do, I help her mom on uh, if it's arranging the song. And videos, I do her videos, like all her videos. Yeah, so I support her wherever I can and whenever I can. There's some serious sibling love. You know, it, yeah. I don't even think me and my big brother have this kind of relationship. <laughs> but then, bro, I'm going to you come around and mm. there's that. What? That, that's so, you know, that, that's really inspiring, you know, for siblings to work together and support each other. Mm. That's very good. Um, Briefly, now tell us about that. New Kosana Kwa Studio. Because I think you also shoot her videos yeah, too. Yeah. yeah, I mean, tell us about the squabbles in the sets and all that stuff. Yeah, we have a lot of disagreements in studio, probably. You know, there's a way she wants her covers to be, her songs to be. Yeah. And I feel like I've been here in the game like for a year plus and they know what yeah. the industry needs. Yeah. You know, it's not like um, you, has, you, you, you own advantage. People mm -hmm. want to listen to a specific thing. Yeah. So, how do you want so at the end of the day, it's her song. Mm -hmm. So the advantage is Sijayu um, Mwambia. Me and I sell, he has done a lot So me and I sell, we have made a lot of final product. Yeah. So me and I sell, he has made a lot of instrument. He has made a lot And at the end of the day, it comes out to me. Perfect. Yeah. Is she planning to do yeah. original music too, or she's just basically a cover artist? Um, I think for now she does. She will do covers. Because yeah. Because you're measuring more on marketing. Yeah. But her she has brand. she has her officials. Too. Yeah. Okay. That's nice. That's nice. Okay. Now tell us about your wonderful, bubbly, beautiful director, Jerry. <laughs> With Jerry, like in your status, you can tell us the locations, you can tell us where you are, you can tell us where you are. She looks like a very amazing person, you guys seem very close. Tell us about her. First, thank you for stopping me. Oh! Oh, I'm saying, are you serious? Oh, I'm saying, I'm telling you, hey, Sawa, Sawa, you're welcome. You're welcome. So, um, Jerry, Jerry is... Uh-huh. Jerry is a um, lovely woman mm -hmm. who supports me. 
Yo, yo, Tyrell, at uh, least give us a few bars of one of your original songs. Maze to Bambike Kiasi. But exclusive! So. <clears throat> Oh baby, baby, it's you. You are the true definition of love. Na roho yangu imekuridhia. And when I hear your voice, na kwanga umeni maliza. Oh, thank you so much. <laughs> Can you get it to me? Ah, come on. Of course. Oh, really? Yeah. I love you too. I love you too. Ah. <laughs> Yeah. So, um, of course, I'd like us to know about that we have done a collab together. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. Love the one. collab yet. As he's only come, I'm blowing the trumpet up. Uh, the collab is a very dope one. Yeah. It's done by one of the top Kenyan producers. Yo, bo, 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 bo. Yo. Ihaji, Ihaji did it, <coughs> and it's such a nice song. We've uh, also done it to drum on. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, when are we releasing it? That would be a surprise for them. To see what I'm going to be. I'm going to be a little bit of 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 a little you know, my song number many top and Dusuma and Dusuma originally was produced by Haji. Yeah. So Ihaji and Yongo Mania make kill. Make kill everything. Vocals, instrumental, yeah. everything. So my dream was to meet him. Mm -hmm. You know? And when I met him, I was like, I'm going to go to the YouTube. Yeah. I came back on and he appreciated. I said, my cell is fine because I'm Zulu. He did a good job. Mm. And I really thank him for making Dusuma a hit because when I was a yeah. co producer, I was a Zulu. I was a Zulu. I was a Zulu. So I really thank Ihaji because through that, is, um, my breakthrough came through. Yeah. Yeah, so uh, I really owe it to that guy. Yeah. It Plus, he's a dream. very humble guy. Yeah, he a is. Very humble he guy. He is, he yeah. is, yeah. Me personally, my me working with Haji gave me growth as an artist. Yeah. And, um, you know, also working with Alfajiri because yeah. basically they write like most of my music. Yeah. It's really amazing. Do you plan to work on other projects with the Haji or where we go exclusively? Mm -hmm. SL on the beat! <laughs> I've done one with Ihaji. Oh wow, I didn't know that. <laughs> okay. Yeah, so congratulations. Yeah, thank you, Nivile Niko Mombasa. So mm -hmm. he makes the instrumental. Because you know, SL akuna tachiake. Yeah. Ihaji tachiake, Tedibi tachiake. Every mm -hmm. producer akuna tachiake. So I needed much more of his touch on a certain project. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So he sent the beat. Yeah. Um, so have you worked to, uh, with Ihaji on other projects apart from our collab? Or have you worked with any mm -hmm. other producer apart from SL? Not really. Um, I really trust Esel with my projects uh -huh. because he knows me. He mm -hmm. knows me touch. Mm -hmm. He knows what I want in a song. Mm -hmm. And after we worked on Ihaji, we uh, to me find another song. Okay. <clears throat> yeah, to me find another song. Is that so, okay? Ayo Badu. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, the thing is, um, here from Nairobi, he sends the beat. I love we do the vocals, mm -hmm. and I sell. Mm -hmm. You know, yeah. So the mastering, mastering, me sell, like to me sell. When I just say Haji, ni kila kila producer kona tachi yake. So ni lana taka tachi Haji, because sell ana tachi yake. Tibi yake, Haji yake, Enga yake. So I wanted the Haji, but vocals bado me sell. So do you have like any upcoming collabs with major artists, or do you aspire to work with any major artists? Um, I was arranging for some collabs, but we had uh, Hitches Kiasi. Um, but obviously they'll come. Well, the ones I'm targeting is um, Otili, of course. Of course. Masauti. It's about time. Mm, yeah. yeah. Masauti. I'm sure again I'm a manager as well. Mm. So you just have to lay plans down. Corona did claim an effect, by the way. Mm -hmm. We have to work uh, on something with Otili. Mm -hmm. which, um, the manager said, Corona plans in any a bit yeah. yeah so yeah i think those are the two artists that i'm having an eye on yeah and, and simple boy simple boy <laughs> i love that, that, boy. Ever, <laughs> ever, <laughs> ever, <laughs> that yeah, guy yeah. so you're a big fan of him yeah we talk he's a good guy he's a very good guy humble mm -hmm. and down to earth yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. that's good that's good that's good so um why simple boy i, I just have to ask about that Simple boy, you know, uh, when doing a collabo, you, you have to see kama itakuelevet, ama itakuleta chini. Simple boy ni mtu anapendwa na watu. 
mm. same applies to major yeah you know so when you invest your cash there you're supposed to like um make sure it elevates you yeah yeah okay so uh, <laughs> Management. Mm. You are uh, last time you were here. You were <coughs> under a uh, certain management, or if somebody was managing you, mm -hmm. uh, how's that going for you? Um, right now, I'm not under any management. Nili poko pa last time. It was a somebody, it was specific, not mm -hmm. like a label. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But um, things didn't really work out well. Mm -hmm. So I'm just alone. Yeah, you're yeah. just alone. So wait. Okay, so I took a meaning that um, we took my gigs, all these other things. The way we How is it as a mm. as a like a sort of like a new artist in the industry? How is it working mm. without management? How's that working out for you? Because it can't be easy. Because mm. at the end of the day, you're just one person. You know, you, you can't you can't split yourself mm. and you do promotion, you do this, you're in the studio. I mean, tell us about that experience. As experience working with no uh, management. It's kind of tough. Yeah. Because um, uh, tell us how is it working without management? Like you previously said, you don't have a manager or did you have a falling out first of all with your previous manager um we had issues had issues and it was a bit personal uh -huh. so i'd uh, nika sort out kufanya to kazi peke yeah and um without a management is kind of hectic yeah know, because um mziki ni all about money yeah you know, to get yourself outside there yeah to be played to yeah. shoot to do everything so as you've said you have to look for shows on your own you have to do everything on your own, so it kind of gets tough because kito ango mo endo nanza ku market. Yeah. Uh, personally speaking, um, ni kona covers mingi si jai toa. Yeah. Because unatoa hi unamaliza pesa. Yeah. And so you have to wait and regain again to mm. do another cover. Yeah. Watika vume fanya by the time utaka kutoa yoka vengi ni mepito na wakati. Yeah. So kama wangu nadia sana ipe ni lifanya kolabo ya wilipo ni lifanya but zilini. Peter too, kuna vinye, kama semi ni lifanya ni love, ya otile na alikiba, ni kakuja Nairobi kui market, media tour. Nikirudi, uh, yote ime ku market, ingine ime toka, so I can't record, I'm still in Nairobi. Yeah. Nikirudi, yote ime pito na wakati, yeah. kuna ingine ime toka, you know, yeah. so, it, inakonga hetik at times. Yeah. yeah. Speaking of covers, what are the disadvantages of doing covers as a as an uprising star mm. on your perspective? Because I'm sure there are some you know things that you've encountered and maybe you've, you thought well, you know like if i've not done covers probably i'd be somewhere mm. different i mean what are the what are the disadvantages basically of doing covers as you look at the camera maybe there's an artist out there who wants mm. to come out as a cover artist mm. you need our advice uh disadvantages of your covers and the advantages of doing covers you know basically just walk them through because you know most people do not know where to start i'm aware to expect after yeah. they remove <coughs> the covers and um you know just briefly as you look at the camera okay one one disadvantage ni unajamini kitu wa cover nataka itezo kwa media for marketing kuna media zingine sneaky or approach they don't play covers when i say we want your official song um pia radio stations you know so one of the disadvantages how una pass places in guinea so the the only place you can function freely with a cover is on youtube um pia sa zingine people say you ukifanya cover you hiding your, your capability like kama hujui kuandika wimbo you know some tuna zasema like una jificha utaki tujue kama unaandika nyimbo mbovu ama mzuri kwa na sauti yes but you need to do your own songs so I think um, that's the disadvantage of come across mm -hmm. only. And advantages of doing covers? Advantages cars? are they give you like leeway, free subscribers, free views, free money, free everything. Mm. Because um, like this cover I've done recently, such kind of love, Rivani and um, who? Otile, Otile. Jovio. Yeah. Ni me, even if I tell like 300 plus subscribers. Wow, in, congratulations. Mm, yeah. Wow, that's amazing. That's amazing. That's amazing. So, like, um, do you intend to continue doing covers? Or at this time, you're just going to do original music? Definitely, I'll do covers. Okay. I love, as in, I've grown to love covers. Okay. It's nice. In a good way, you grow vocally. Yeah. Mm. Because you have to sing more than Otili. Yeah. You yeah. have to sing more than Rivani, Bahati, Pose, all those people. Yeah. So, you, you get, like me, personally, um, my vocal ranges in a panda. Hmm. Don't we know it? <laughs> Don't we know it? <laughs> yeah, man, that's that's amazing. I'm so proud of you, you know, because I've personally known you as a individual, you know, yeah. and I've known you as an artist, and yeah. I've seen the growth you've had. Now, this is one question. Last 
ziliana wapi? Cuz last time ulikuwa hapo ulikuwa umeshuka nywele. What happened? Is this a new look? Is this Tyrell 4.0? What's what's happening here? Not really. Um I'm planning on doing the dreads again. Mm -hmm. But uh, in the process um I've fallen kwa masalonists wengi yeah. trying to find the right person mm -hmm. who can do something good for me. Mm -hmm. So in the process nywele zikaanza kukatika and oh. all that. So Olé. I shaved. Okay. Nianze tena. That's how I've done a hat. Uh -huh. But the Tyrell will wear dreads and a kujenga. I love that identity. Yeah, you look amazing. Mm. You look yeah. amazing. You still look good. At one get by. You know, <laughs> we don't say about that, but yeah. you look amazing. You know, you. we love the way you're you're looking good. You maintain. You got two sides. Oh, Zayn, me omoka. Tyrell, my Zayn. No, no, no. Do sponsor up on my Zayn. Oh, Zayn, me omoka. This guy looks like money here, yeah. man. Mm. But you look good though, you look good. Um, kindly, if you can give guys your social media handles mm -hmm. as we wind up with one of with your latest song, which mm -hmm. is called To Introduce, yeah. Alafu, our DJ on set, will sort you out and then to Tawacha na Uzuri. Kama Kawaida, guys, I've been your host, Ronka the Lioness, and this has been Lioness Say So Catch Us Fast on Base Safaricom TV. Kama Kawaida, guys, Keep subscribing, keep liking, keep sharing, keep commenting. Now, Penda Sana, God, our bless. Acha ni achie Tyrell, our pate social media. Zake Jumimi, I'm Auri. Okay, you can find me on YouTube at Tyrell Kenya. On Instagram, I love Tyrell. Ooh, don't we all. On Facebook, Sean Tyrell. Yeah. S E N, Sean Tyrell. Sean Tyrell. Sean is your real name. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, Mr. DJ, I do not know what you're waiting for, Tyrell. Baku